And a young boy in Colorado just participated in his first legal snowball fight. You'll remember a few months back, we brought you the story of Dane Best. He petitioned to change a law in his hometown of Severance that made throwing snowballs illegal. Now, the law is over 100 years old, and his story instantly grabbed international attention. He ultimately won his legal battle, but at the time, there was no snow on the ground. That all changed a few days ago. I'm here today to hopefully change the law about throwing snowballs. Sounds like you've just changed the law, buddy. We are having our first legal snowball fight. It's crazy. I've never had that much attention before. <laughs> the story has continued to snowball. An author wrote a children's book and producers are in touch with the family about a possible movie. So, Kurt, Heather, he may be getting some more attention now yeah, after all this. Yeah, it goes to show you can fight City Hall with a Apparently. snowball. Yeah. No matter how old you are, too. <laughs> yeah.